Hello everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Sly 2. In the previous episode, we screwed up with bears a lot, and uh, we redirected a laser beam through the entire level, which was very fun. Today, we're going to try and do something else. We're going to try talking more, maybe, talking about the game, talking about other things, talking about life, you know, other stuff that will make sense, maybe. Um, with the topics of everything that's happening in the game. And uh, I guess we're going to also play as Murray, because we did both the slime missions that episode. So, hey, there we go. Bum, 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 bum. Gotta remember all of his moves here. That, this belly flop fire move is fantastic. Can we take out the bear with it? Do you think we're that tough? Do you think we're that tough? I, I don't know. Let's, let's clap our hands together just in case we're not that tough. I don't even think we can actually take out the bear, but it might be possible. Ready? <laughs> Did we just scare him off? Or he's just, he's just focused on something else. He's like, oh, I can't take on a hippo. Murray's just so tough, though, that we didn't die in one hit to that bear. So that's really good. Rumor has it that several off-duty guards meet in that cabin for an RC combat club. This is going to be great. I haven't been in any RC combat since that job we pulled in Istanbul. It was awesome. All right. Uh, interesting. I guess you, uh, you've done these kinds of things before, Murray? This seems like it's going to be a fun mission. I don't know what it's going to be, but it seems like it's going to be a fun one. Those guards will never let you into the combat club without a disguise. That old moosehead should do the trick. Only there's no way for you to get up there. Hide out in this barrel while I send in Sly to steal the head. <laughs> Hide out in this barrel? Can he fit? <laughs> Sly, if you can get the stuffed moosehead without being detected, Murray should be able to join the RC combat club without raising any suspicion. Oh yeah, definitely. This this moose head, is it did it actually like is it a dead moose? They just have this head in there, or is this like a wooden carving moose? Oh no. Weird that we have to start this one as Murray, but you know what? I'll take it. Let me just uh take these things out of your back pockets. Thank you. And this guy over here has some goodies. Oh. Thank you. All that money. Oh, a little medium nugget. Oh, this guy over here also has some goodies. Let me just go grab his goodies real quick. Uh, do not sound bite that. Thank you. Fantastic. Amazing. Now, how do we get up top? We can't slow down. I, I just noticed my foot's in his, his light, flashlight there. Whoops. I think we still get to keep the things that we stole from them, though, right? Maybe? Is this how we, uh, is, did I find a boosting way to get money otherwise? Let me just take this stuff out of his pocket again. Maybe we get more stuff. Maybe this is like a secret way of getting a ton of loot keep dying in this level and wait for them to respawn, yeah? I'm sure no one cares. Oh, jeez. <laughs> no one cares about uh, money boosting in this game by now. Maybe it's possible, though. I don't know. Alright, whereabouts are we have, do we have to go over here? Do not touch any of the bottles. Uh, change the camera, thank you. Oh, shoot. We're dead. Oh, we're okay. Swing, swing, swing. Oh, jeez. This is... This is some... Interesting work. Ow, that hurt. No, we're back to the beginning. Okay, I'll be right back. Okay, this time, let's try w being patient. Just a little patient. There we go. Good. Run and go. The Canadian flags on everything, just to say... Or, like, the maple leaf leaves maple leaves on everything just to be like hey we're in Canada 
is uh, a pretty nice touch. Oh, we gotta crawl through all this. This is terrifying. Don't lose your head, Sly. You'll be okay. It's okay, these aren't uh, Maple Leaf brand saws, so you should be okay. They'll be a little duller. Yeah, that should be fine. Whoa, whoa. Ah, oh, it almost so close. He's dozing off, perfect timing. Fantastic, we made it. A little lag spike, but we made it. Where's this moose head at? Oh, it's not, we're, we still got a little bit more parkour to go through before we get there. There we go. I haven't had to crawl under tables for a while to get past anyone. And where, oh, let's just yoink this real quick out of your back pocket, sir. Thank you, thank you. Um, am I supposed to take this guy out? Fighting the guards fails this stealth job. Are you kidding me? How am I supposed to do it? Am I supposed to send him the other direction then, maybe? I feel like an absolute speedrunner doing this now. Now that I know how to get around this entire level. Uh, I'm thinking, can we... Oh, he has another thing in his back pocket. Okay, wait. Just gotta take this out real quick because I've been doing that with all of them. I wonder if this stuff's all stacking, like if we actually have all this stuff just holding on to it all, that would be fantastic. We're gonna have so much money by the end of this level. Uh, let me try and throw one of these bad boys. Ha 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 ha, let's go. Murray, heads up. Any of you guys think you can beat the mer the, the moose? Maybe put a bet on it. Oh, I'm in, eh? I ain't got a lot of money for this wager, but there's no way I lose to a new guy like you, huh? That RC combat drone takes some skill to control. Steer with the left analog stick and hold down the X button for gas. After you collect a fallen ammo, press the square button to fire its turret. Here's a pro tip. You can only aim the turret while you're stopped. Whoa, this is gonna be weird. Uh, anyone else notice that the new guy's mouth isn't moving while he's talking and he kind of smells like a dead version of us? Maybe, possibly. I don't know, it could be a thing. Okay, I'm seeing how this works. Ventriloquist Murray, doing his thing. Oh my goodness, this thing has some kick to it, doesn't it? Oh, he hurt himself, okay. This was actually a little bit weird to control at first, but now that we're doing it, it doesn't seem too bad. You won, eh? But I ain't got no money. That might be okay. It all depends. Depends on what? On whether or not you know the location of the Northern Light Battery. Oh well, I guess I owe ya. You just happen to know the location? After reading through the log shopping guide, it's become painfully clear that to win in the Lumberjack games, we'll have to cheat. Now, I've constructed a plan that hinges around us acquiring an eagle's egg, which is more difficult than you'd think. First, Murray needs to lure a bear into taking out the local oil mains. Once destroyed, the pressurized oil should ignite and create updrafts, which Sly will then use to paraglide over to the eagle's nest. Grab an egg, and then head back to the safe house. Thanks to Murray's undercover work in the RC Combat Club, we've learned that the Northern Light Battery is hidden in a silo nearby. The battery needs some serious modification if we're going to hide inside it to sneak onto Arpeggio's blimp. First, we'll short the battery with grapple lines on local boats. Then, we'll all break into the lighthouse and sever the power flow to the battery. That way it won't recharge. 
Given my electrical engineering background, this plan has a 97% chance of success. Pretty good, huh? What about that other uh, 3%, huh? Huh? What about that? So, uh... Yeah, I, I understood the first half of the mission. He lost me in the second half, but I'm sure they'll tell us what to do later on. Uh, so anyway, we gotta go and play as... We're gonna be Murray. We're gonna get some updrafts for Sly and... And Sly's gonna get some eagle egg. That was about the part that I was like, okay, this seems pretty straightforward. I got this. I understand. And then he started talking about some engineering stuff, and I was just like, nope, I'm out. Bye. <laughs> I ain't listening to you anymore. I'm gone. It's about to get uh, really complex. If we're gonna get an eagle egg, you'll first have to destroy all the local oil mains. It looks pretty sturdy. The Murray is strong, but his fists can't punch through metal. No problem. See that old bear down there? His name is Grizzleface. The guards ignore him because he's blind and practically nerve dead, except for his sense of smell. If that old guy smells fish, there's no stopping him. Use Grizzleface to take out the oil mains. But I don't smell like fish. Do I? How can I lure him around? Bentley's taken up a post along the river. He'll keep tossing bombs into the water, and the fish should get blown sky high. Plenty should land near your position. So, you want me to throw a fish at the oil main so that old grizzle face will knock him apart? That's the idea. You might even try throwing fish at the guards. Might improve their odor. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's doing some, uh, what's that, what's that kind of fishing called when you throw dynamite into the water and just watch the fish get blown up? Um... I was gonna. S <laughs> the only thing coming to my mind is fly fishing, and I'm like, no, that's not. That's not fly fishing. Definitely not. Hey, Murray, can we get. Oh, that's a big fish. That bear can run pretty fast. He's on the way. Yoink. There we go. There's a big fish. Oh, maybe we have to actually hit it. Bentley. Bentley. Stop sneezing. I need a fishy. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, jumping is gonna be very helpful. Perfect. Nice work. Trot old Grizzleface over to the next oil main by luring him with fish. Thwack. Bentley, please, can we get some more fishies? I think I, there is one right there that just despawned. I'm gonna cook this fish because it's in my hands while they're on fire. I think there's one right here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where's the uh, bear and how do we get him over here? Oh, is he right there now? Ooh, wait, they gave us a fish right here. Bentley's just gonna keep letting, having fish land on top of us? That's so nice of him. Oh, jeez! <laughs> I'm getting so many jump scares today. I know that would have been, like, mm, an episode ago? Yeah, the last episode, maybe? But holy moly, I'm getting scared so easily for some reason today. I don't know what's causing it. So do I not have to bring this fish wherever we go? I'm, or do I have to keep coming back to Bentley and grabbing the fish? Let's see. Oh, it does just land by us. Okay. Where is he? Where's Mr. Bear's Grizzle? Coming. Said he's coming, but I don't know. I don't know. I don't see him. Oh, there he is. Come on, Mr. Grizzle face. Wow, look at him go. He's so strong at knowing his, his scent here. Throw that. Oh, I didn't mean to throw it at the guy, but hopefully that works. Please attack it. Please attack it. Okay, you're not going to attack. attack that. Ooh, I punched him in the face. I didn't mean to punch you. I didn't mean to punch you, friend. We need another fish. Bentley, stat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Perfect. Okay, one more. 
I heard another fish. There it is. Grab it. Yeah, we gotta go. Oh, there's water right here. Whoops. I love that the fish just spawns wherever you are. That's very nice of them. I thought we had to keep going back to Bentley. Okay, mm -mm -mm. one more thing to take out. How are we going to get over there with Murray? Oh, jeez! Oh, I'm just going to throw it like that. I'm going to get over here. Run this way. Go, 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 go. And throw it. Oh, well, you know, that will work. Maybe the bear will want to attack him for a second. We're gonna die. Sensors in the safe house indicate that Grizzle Face is on the move. That's nice. I'm just taking out all the guys here. Gotta keep making this thing smell like fish over here. Grizzle Face has caught the scent. He's coming. He is, but I don't see him. But we're gonna I'm assuming he's gonna come up this way unless he's stuck somewhere else. Oh wait, there he is. So you're just gonna come around here. Yeah. Solid work, Murray. Now that the oil lights are exposed, Sly's all set up for a paragliding job off the lighthouse. Wait, off of the lighthouse? Oh, I thought I thought we were going somewhere else. Seventy-six percent done. We're three quarters of the way through. Guys, the game's gonna be over soon. Then we're gonna have to move on to the next game, which uh, mm, I don't know how long, how much time's left of this game, but holy moly, we have. Well, we should check and see how much we can sell. Um, but yeah, I'm trying to get ahead on the recordings, like super duper far. I know I mentioned this before, like a few days ago, but um, I'm working really hard trying to get ahead. And cool, they all stacked. That's awesome. Look at all this goody, 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 goody. Uh, I don't know what we want to buy yet though. Uh, like the slowing time seems fun, but I, it wasn't very useful to us last time. Hmm, I don't know. I really don't know. Let's just hold on to our money for now. Alright. So we have two Sly missions over here. I think we got time for one more in this episode? We can do one more mission? Now, which one do we do? Do we do this one, or do we do the one from the top? We just set up the one for the top. So I'm wondering if we can do that. Oh, that, don't do that. <laughs> oh, we get to run along this really nice area again. It's so nice. Do we have to climb the tower from the outside, or do we go inside the tower? Or like the, yeah, the lighthouse. Do we go in here? They haven't run around over here. Maybe there's a clue or something over here? Oh, jeez. Uh, here's the front door. Hmm. I'm not sure. Do we jump on this? Oh, that did not bring us to the, where we wanted to go. Maybe I can go on top of this one right here. I hear a jingle jangle. Is it up here? That lighthouse is the conduit for collecting the northern lights. We need to shut it down, or the silo battery will continue to fill with energy, making it impossible for us to stow away inside. So, you want me to go in there and bust the thing up? Sounds like work for Murray. Actually, this job will require all three of our skills. The front door is locked, and you're the only one capable of climbing up to the hatch on top. Once inside, sneak down to the ground floor and let us in. We'll help you finish the job. All right, see you on the ground floor. Ah, that's a cool idea for a mission. I hear your little jingly jangly. Where are you? Where are you jingling? Are you right there? Was that it right there? It was. We found you. 
These last few clues are all hidden around the level. Bum, 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 bum. I hear another jingle. <gasps> right there. Is this the jingle I was hearing, though? We haven't been on this side of the map. That's why I'm just, like, hearing all these things. Yeah, that was the jingle. Look at that. Wow. Okay, so we have to go back into the lighthouse. Um... Okay, I guess we're doing the lighthouse mission? Okay. Um, they were saying something about using the paraglider to glide to a certain location. I thought that's what we were doing all the way over here, but maybe we can get to the top of the lighthouse now, now that we can do this and do it do it that way. I, I, I don't know. I'm not really sure how this is working. Okay, do not go in there. Do I have to, like, climb on the... Oh, oh I did, once again, didn't see the ice. Didn't even think about the fact that we could climb on ice and just happen to get really lucky with pressing circle at the right place. Oh, but there's falling icicles. Clink, 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 clink. That sound effect is so nice. The sound effects for like all these games are so good. It's so satisfying sounding. I forgot that there was icicles right there. I was just going through it anyway. Oh boy. Okay, icicle, icicle. This isn't how icicles work. They don't grow that fast. Nice climbing, Sly. You made it up to the hatch. <laughs> ah, so we could go. But we already started this mission to get up here. Oh, well. oh, look at this. Look at this thing. We're gonna have to take that at some point too. We can't go to the tippy tip top yet. Okay, get to the bottom of the lighthouse. This is, uh, this is a different kind of mission. Normally we have to go up. I died while he was talking. Always happens. I always do it at least once. Always cut them off. Now we're never going to hear what he has to say, right? Oh, they reset it! Oh, that's so good! Okay, the last game, that didn't work. I can talk over the first half because we've already heard him talk. But Okay, I cannot touch that middle section at all. We've learned that. <laughs> Oh wow, so he was basically at the end of what he was saying last time. I just happened to die at the same point. Oh well. Now you guys get to hear it twice. <laughs> just gonna take this stuff out of your back pocket, sir. Thank you. Those sapphires are worth so much. Okay, sneaky sneaky, we're walking right into that. Easy mode! E oh, <laughs> I thought we did it. I thought we got to the bottom the cheaty way. Grabbed a few more things from everyone's pockets there. And now we're good to go again. Oh, Ooh, he's doing a slight little walk. Do we have some controller drift going on here? Or is he just doing that automatically because we're going down? Go, 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 go. Long strides. Sweet. We're doing it. Oh, that's a light. That's still a light. <laughs> I don't know why I thought I could jump over it while it was going the same direction, but uh, don't question it. Okay. Oh, jeez. That's so fast. Is this not what I'm supposed to do? Oh, wait, maybe I just break it. Thanks, pal. Just let me at that Northern Light Attractor. It'll be slagging minutes. Not quite that simple, Murray. 
I'll reverse the energy flow from the control computer while you lift the main circuit breaker. That should give Sly a short window of opportunity to climb up the power lines and overload the system from the top. Up, down, up, down. They should put an elevator in this place. Yeah, they should. Come on. Flip the switch at the top. Oh my goodness. Is Murray just peeing on the wall? It looks like he's just peeing over there. Oh, this guy had something in his back pocket, but too late. Already killed him. Do I jump on this? Get climbing, Sly. We can't keep this thing reversed forever. Yeah, this is heavier than it looks. Okay, I'm trying to jump. Oh my goodness, I'm just jumping onto it as it's zapping it each time. <laughs> okay, okay, we're doing it. We're doing something this time. A lot of focus involved, but we're doing something. Flip the double reverse circuit breaker. Hurry! Oh. We did it! The collection mechanism is overloading! That was so tricky. <laughs> These missions are so difficult. Uh, hurry, Sly. You're almost out of time. Wait. Wait. I didn't mean to fall all the way to the bottom. Where am I supposed to go now? Do I go up? Was, was that it? Okay, let's just booby trap. Bring this thing booby trapped one back. Uh, it shouldn't be too bad, right? getting tighter with the time oh that bird almost got us oh okay let's sell these things I don't know if we're completely done that mission it it sounded like we still have a thing to do there I'm not entirely sure if we still do or not uh, it's very confusing to me um, but I think I'm going to leave this episode there and uh, in the next episode we'll figure out what we missed uh if we missed something otherwise we'll continue doing it we'll do the side thing on the outside at the top and we'll do the other stuff on the inside with murray or something i don't know i don't know if we need to do anything else in that mission maybe we finished it all anyway i want to thank everyone for watching this episode of slide two and i hope you all have a great rest of your day goodbye for now my friends